Hey Royals, as promised, I am giving you a tour of my bathroom makeover. I recently shared this space in a cleaning hop that I did with my beautiful dream team sisters. And in that video, you guys seem to really enjoy this space. And I promise to come back and give you details on everything. That video was solely dedicated to the cleaning and for me, the styling was a bonus, but again, you all were so inquisitive on things in the space. I thought it would be fitting to come back and give you all an overview and then take my time and give you detail by detail on everything that was used to style this particular space. Okay guys, so we're going to start from the shower curtain and work our way over. I picked this actual set of window panels, you guys. It's not traditional shower curtains. I always use window panels and I believe these are 84 in length. They are a beautiful aqua colored velvet. You guys know how I feel about my aqua slash Tiffany blue, Robin's egg blue, however you want to say it. That's my judge. And when I originally shared the video, I had the panels open, it was one on either side, but because of functionality and we live here, it just was more convenient to do it this way. And I love this dramatic draping and I use a tassel that I had from Ross from, for years, you guys. Um, I got a set of two of those, so probably like $6.99. And I simply just type, um, took it in, did the little tie back on the um, curtain just to give a little dramatics in make it more functional so that my family wouldn't have to keep bothering it, moving it, touching it whenever they came into the shower. So that is that. And then the actual wall art, I have a set of two. There's one here and then there's one on the other side you'll see shortly. I got these from Burlington a couple of years ago and I think they have repeated them. I've been seeing people share them in their hall. So they are back if you're interested. I think they were $19.99 for the, um, each piece. So again, that's from Burlington. Oh, I didn't show where I got these from. I got these from TJ Maxx a couple of years ago, so I'm not sure if this is even linkable, but if I can link anything similar, I will. The florals here, you guys, I wanted to add that splash of color, and I chose peach, because I think with the blue and the gray, you can use any color, but I just thought the peach was a perfect combination for the spring season. And so here I have a bush bushel of Flaws from Amazon and then one from Hobby Lobby. And I'll try to link each one of them. So that's actually two, maybe even three in that particular vase. This vase was a Christmas gift from my mother in love. The tray was a confiscation from my daughter. She was changing out her look, so I just got it right off of her hand. And I always love to give my bathroom that hotel vibe feel. And I love when you go to a nice luxury hotel, they have the little washed house folded in the little, um, what I call Tootsie Rolls. So I just did three there. You can do as many as you like. You can do it in color you like, but I just liked it because it ties in with the color scheme, okay? Um, you guys went crazy over this little stamping on the towel, on the paper, the toilet paper, but I will share that with you. I will actually do that with you on the video here shortly. And I just do that if I come in and I see that someone has used it just for the aesthetic of it all. And then the, shop the toilet cleaner in the trash can i picked the one up from 
Burlington, I think that one came from, no, that one came from Home Goods. The toilet cleaner came from Home Goods, and the trash can itself came from TJ Maxx, okay? Although these sets, these pieces all look very much alike, they were purchased at different places. The tray, I know I got that from TJ Maxx. I got the bowl here from Burlington. These are years ago, you guys. I've had this set for quite some time because I'm one that once I find colors I love, I don't stray. I may add a new um, accent color, but I pretty much keep this bathroom in the blues in something, whether it's blue and charcoal, blue and like a silver now, or I've done blue and I think chocolate, I believe, a while ago, but I love the blues. And so the soap dispensers, let's see if that still has a tag on them. No. I have lotion in one and then I have um, antibacterial soap in the other. I got these from Burlington and I got the round um, soap dish from Burlington, okay? Another thing you guys really, really loved in that video that I did with the Dream Team was the way that I folded my towels. Now the looks are similar and I will actually demonstrate here shortly how I did that. I just kind of want to go over everything with you all. The towels are from this one. Both of these are from um, Walmart and they're from the Better Homes and Garden. I just love the texture here. Have tons of them in gray and then I added the beautiful aqua for the spring season. And this, you guys, is actually a bracelet that I use to cuff the towels in. It's an expandable bracelet and that's what I use. So I will share that little technique here shortly. And then this is the other wall piece that I have from Burlington, okay? The mats, you guys, are from Walmart, Better Homes and Garden. Okay, then moving over to here, I got, again, these are all from Walmart, Better Homes and Garden Collection. Their towels are really, really good quality because I've had several colors. I have this color and this design that I use in my bathroom, and I've had them since I moved here, so like 2017. They're still in very good shape. They're launder easily, have no problems out of them. So I knew that when I added this collection, it won't be a problem either. So that is that look. And then here, this is a bath towel, and then this is a full, like, um, towel that you, the full size towel that you would dry off with. Again, here is that nice bracelet. I picked these up from, um, we used to be called Dollar Mania, but they was like a little jewelry store that sold all the jewelry for a dollar. So just kept that. And then these little, these little trinket boxes, you guys, are just items we keep like you know personals and then an extra roll of toilet tissue in that there's a piece of something on the floor let's get that okay and then the wall decor i got these sconces from hobby lobby again several years ago but they are still available and i will link them i got them at 50 percent off of course as well as the candles from hobby lobby so there you have it you guys i will give you another Run down. Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me. Chilling all day, all in your space is where I want to be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love I've been trying to forget But you won't let me Something in my brain wants you I've been thinking by myself Asking for help But nothing seems to work on you Yeah You always make me feel like oh yeah You're the reason I'm going out of my mind. I just can't stop thinking about you. Okay, Royals, I hope you enjoyed the tour as well as the step by step instructions on how to do the bath tissue stamping as well as the bath towel folding. If this is your first time visiting and you see what you like and you like what you see, I want to invite you to please join the royal family. As you can see, we are full of inspiration, motivation, and creativity. To my tried and trues and my brand new booze, you guys know that I so love and appreciate you. Thank you all for your continued support. Well, guys, 
there are yet more videos to share. I still have a master bedroom amazing makeover as well as a ultra glam dining room makeover to share, some outdoor styling, and so much more. So set your notification bells. You don't want to miss a single upload. But until the next one, I want you all to always be royal, stay safe, and have a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day. See you in the next one. Bye.